Hey, Robert, the kennel boss here. And um, as you can see behind me, you'll see a lot of cages and things like set, set up for all the cats that are out here. And back in the back here, I've got a full house, 48 dogs. Now, the shelter is designed, of course, to take in refugees. People, or people, <laughs> kitties and dogs, critters that do not have a home. Now, what would you think of a shelter who just turned away those critters in need just because we didn't want them here? Yeah, you would think that we're pretty much the crap that I scoop up in the morning, right? Now, we have to take them in simply because we lend aid to critters in need. We lend aid to our four-legged refugees. But there does come a point whenever the resources that we have get taxed. And we have had to turn uh, four-legged refugees away because we are full. When we are full, it means that we have no place to put them. It means that our resources are very much hit in that regard. But once we're able to take them, we take them in. We've taken in um, dogs that are very aggressive, bully breeds, whatever's happened to them with their history. We don't discriminate whenever we're taking in our four-legged critter refugees. And I think from the standpoint of the refugee crisis that's going on around in the different countries and things like that, and people coming into our country, we need to be a little careful about who we say no to and why, simply because we are supposed to lend aid. We are supposed to lend aid to those in need. But at the same time, if different states and agencies are taxed, and they can't, with resources that they have, take any in, then we can't take any in. I mean, right now, at the shelter, if we had someone come in with like about 40 or 50 cats and dogs, we can't take them in because we have no room. We would have to, in essence, close our borders, so to speak. But whenever we do have room, we take them in because that's what we do. We lend aid to our four-legged refugees in need. So, you know, if you can do it, take them in, help. If you can't, well, you can't. But say no for the right reasons, man. You know, don't just say, I'm not gonna take you because I don't like the way you look or your swagger or anything like that. But, yeah, that's just my two cents. Later.